Start in a child's pose position, feet together, knees spread nice and wide, and reaching your hands out in front while resting your forehead down onto your mat. Start to bring attention to your breath as you take a nice big inhale through your nose and exhale right back through your nose. Nice and steady. On the walk your hands over towards the left side of your body, pulling your right hips down towards your mat, feeling that elongation through the left side of your body as you continue with a nice steady breath. Walk your hands back to the center and then over towards the right side of your body, this time pulling your left hips down into the mat. Walk your hands back to the center, reach your fingertips out a little bit further and then come up to a tabletop position, all fours, fingers spread nice and wide. Adding in a few hip circles, figure eights, press your hips to the left and over to the right and back. Just being plainful here. Come up into a high plank position and then back to a child's pose. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, back to child's pose. Inhale, high plank. Back to child's pose. Inhale, high plank. Shift your weight forward, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, up cobra, up dog. And as you're exhaling, back to downward facing dog. And then from down dog, just shift your hips over towards the left side of your body. On your tippy toes, back to the center, and then over towards the right side of your body. Coming back to downward dog on your tippy toes, bring your chest a little bit closer to your thighs and start to walk your feet to the top of the mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back, lower down. Reverse swan, arms down by your side as you inhale, you lift up, reach our hands up high to the sky, look up, reach up through your chest, and then bring your hands back down, cactus arms, inhale, reach back up, exhale, swan dive forward, inhale, halfway lift, flat back, hands down onto your mat, jump back or step back, chaturanga, inhale, up cobra or down dog, coming back to down dog. Inhale, the right leg high to the sky. Bend that right knee. Let that foot fall over towards the left side, stacking your hips, coming back to down dog. Right knee to right elbow. Inhale, back up to down dog, bending that knee back over. On the exhale, right knee to right elbow. Inhale, back up to the three-legged dog. Bend that right knee back over. Inhale, back up. Exhale, right knee to right elbow, hold, knee to nose. You're going to step that foot through, coming to crescent pose, keeping your weight hinged forward, palms face one another. Lower that left knee down, half split as you bring the hands back behind you. Inhale, back to that crescent lunge, keeping your weight forward, then as you exhale, lower down, half split. Inhale, back up to crescent. Exhale, back to that half split. Mm-hmm. Inhale, back up to crescent. And then fly to warrior three. Bring those palms back behind you. And then come down to standing split, reaching that left foot high to the sky, pointing the toe. And then come down to a twist, bringing that left leg down underneath the right, crossing the right over the left. And bringing that left arm and hooking the elbow outside the right knee, taking that spinal twist. Gently releasing, coming back out, hands out in front to lift up and untwist out of that bind. Stepping the left foot back, then the right, high plank to down dog. From down dog, the left side, left foot up, bend that left knee, let it fall over towards the right, three-legged dog, knee to left elbow this time. Inhale, back up, three-legged dog, re-bend that knee, bent three-legged dog. Inhale, back to down dog, left elbow to left knee, 
Inhale, back up one more time, bending that knee, come back down, left knee to left elbow, knee to nose, step it through, coming to a crescent, keep your weight hinged forward, palms face one another. Gently lower that right knee down, half split, drawing those left toes toward you. Inhale, back up to that crescent, hinging forward. On the exhale, lower that right knee down, half split. Inhale, back up to your crescent. And then lower back down, half split. Coming back up to that crescent, hinging your weight forward, shift that weight forward, then fly into warrior three. Slight bend in the standing leg. Bring your palms back behind you. And then lower down, standing splits. Right leg up high to the sky. Point that right toe. Take an inhale, lower down, and bring that right leg behind the left leg, taking a twist on the other side. And then wrapping your right elbow to the outside of the left knee, taking this spinal twist on this side. Gently releasing out of this twist, hands out in front, lift up, high plank to downward facing dog. Inhale that right foot high to the sky. This time exhale, knee to left elbow cross body twist. Inhale back up high to the sky. Exhale, knee to left elbow cross body twist. Inhale back up high to the sky. Exhale, knee to left elbow, cross body twist. Shoot that foot through, come into a fallen star. Lifting those hips up high to the sky, reaching the left arm out over your head. Then lower down, swing the left arm up and take a flow. Lifting up back to fallen star. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, lift up, reach that arm over your head. Exhale, lower back down. One more time, inhale, reach up to that fallen star. And then Place the left hand down to meet the right. Swing that leg through. Stack it on top of the left leg. Side plank. Left arm down. Right arm up. Then flip that leg over. Come into wild thing. Right leg back behind you as you lift those hips up. Reaching that right arm back behind you. And then come back through to downward dog. Exhale that right knee to the right elbow, cartwheel yourself up to a warrior two position. Right knee is bent 90 degrees. Inhale, reverse warrior two. On the exhale, extended side angle, your version of extended side angle. Right arm to the inside of the right leg or the right forearm onto the right thigh. Maybe extending that left arm over your head and then framing that right foot, stepping back to a high plank, chaturanga, lower down slowly. Up cobra, up dog, back to downward facing dog. For the left side, inhale that left foot high to the sky. Exhale, knee to right elbow, cross body twist. Inhale, back up high to the sky. Exhale, knee to right elbow. Inhale, back up high to that sky. Exhale, knee to right elbow. Shoot that foot through, come into that fallen star, lifting that right arm up, hips up high to the sky, extending over your head. Take a big inhale. And then as you exhale, you're just going to drop back down. Use that right arm to swing back up, fallen star. On the exhale, lower back down. Inhale, sweep that right arm up, reach over your head. On the exhale, lower back down one more time. Inhale, sweep up over your head, lift those hips. And then bring that right arm down to meet the left. Come into a side plank on the other side, right hand down, left arm up. Your version of side plank. Take a nice big inhale, bring that left leg onto the top, flip it over into a wild thing, reaching that left arm over your head. From wild thing, flip back over, three-legged dog, and then exhale, knee to nose, step it through, come into warrior two. Heel to arch alignment with the feet, 90 degree bend in the left knee. Inhale, reverse warrior flip. On the exhale, extended side angle, left arm down to the inside of the left leg or the left forearm onto the left thigh, stacking the shoulders or extending that top arm forward. Then frame that left foot, step back to a high plank down. Then we come to a chaturanga. Inhale, up cobra up dog, back to downward facing dog. And then take a child's pose here. 
feet together, knees spread wide, arms out 